Look, my forefathers had the ACA stones before Christ. The knock uh, artworks were before Christ. And as early as that time, before Christ, 500 years before Christ, there is a particular stone that has been dated 70,000 years from Africa. You know, Where so that? yes, it's uh, I can't remember, but you, you know, art historians will, will be more definitive. But the knock and the ACA stones were done before Christ. And of course, you know, where you go down to our own indigenous art, Fribenus, Fribenus came to Africa and he was shocked about what my forefathers could do. Mm. In fact, at that time, he thought, huh, this must have been done by Portuguese, not by Africans. Mm. But Portuguese must have come in here to, to do these things. Um, so, if you look at the history of Nigerian art, um, it predates Christ. And we've contributed a lot. And let me tell you one thing. Again, you have to remember that even the Western world, it, they, 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 they patronized. They were the major clients of artists. People like Leonardo da Vinci, you know, the Medici family, and so on, where he's a major patrons. Uh, people like, uh, you know, Michelangelo, the Medici family, and so on. They patronized. You go to Bruges, you go to uh, Florence, and you go down to... Um, to Mexico and so on, many of the places I've been to, and you see what they've done. Now come back to my country. Yes, my country has contributed a lot to civilization, uh, but unfortunately, our leaders and our people do not appreciate hmm. the greatness of our past and the possibility of using that greatness to improve our future. We've thrown it. We've thrown the baby and the bathwater away. Collection of art is a storage of the history of the people. Art is a way of documenting the way of life of a people. Art is a way of representing the culture of a people. So when you have a collection of art, you are in storage of the history of your people. Mm. I have close to 7,000 works of art under my foundation. And currently I have about 45,000 uh, photographic shots of the various cultural festivals of my people in Nigeria. Um, right from Uboku, the Ofala festival, I've covered it, the Owude festival in Elisha, I've covered the Voodoo festival in Bene Republic, I've covered the Eyo uh, festival, I've covered the um, Igunuko festival, I've covered the Ilaru festival in uh, the Oruno festival in Ilaru, and so on and so forth. So, now tell me, these collections are a reflection of what my forefathers were and what they believed in, their way of life, the way in which they interacted with society, uh, with, with nature, the way they conquered nature. Because what is culture? Culture is the way of life of a set of people in, uh, that they have developed their responses that have been transferred from generation to generation, their responses to nature and to their environment. That is what culture is all about. And what do artists do? Artists document this way of life. Mm. Artists mm. produce... Mm both photography, uh, drawings, paintings, sculptures, and so on and so forth, of the way of life of people. And that's what my collection represents. My collection dates from the Nok culture. Uh, it is the most comprehensive collection in Nigeria because it covers all areas and of facets of Nigerian, of Nigerian art and the country. Mm -hmm. Because it's not only sculptural, it's also traditional, it's uh, modern, and then contemporary. I have I know Nobulu work dating from 1932 in the collection. I have Akinola Shekon. The BBC got in touch with me two weeks ago. They are going to do a documentary of I know Akinola Shekon, and they said I should please give them uh, photographic shots of what I know Nobulu did. Uh, when the Akinola family, uh, family Akinola Shekon family was to do an ex a 40 years posthumous exhibition, they came to me and um, I gave them some of the collections in the. In, the Lashik, in my Lashikon collection. And of course, if you, whatever area of art you want to think about, you know, the collection is a documentation of the history of the creativity of my forefathers and my fathers and my, my brothers and my junior ones and the future ones. That is what the collection is all about. <laughs>